Hello from Slovenia again. Today I will play with my pearl white mixture that it's Vallejo pearl medium mixed with some titanium white and pouring medium that will be my kind of base and I want to do two just dirty <laughs> flip cups I don't know flip and lip no just traveling flip cups uh, and keep some negative space and I have some light gold mixed with uh, this little piggy ore I have bronze I have black and as I said I have my pearl white that I will pour in the bottom and in one cup I will first pour my bronze and in one cup I will first pour my gold I will just and I'm pouring in the cup from up high just a little bit of black I don't want a lot and some bronze and some gold to this one and this should be it and I will add some of this pearl white on the canvas and kind of drag those through or how can I say I don't know just playing with paints and as I said I want to keep some negative space so just Spread this around a little bit. Because with flip cups should be more than enough paint for that. Okie doke. So let's do one here and one here and I will kind of try to cross them we will see and I want a little more white just around the cup here like that let's just Try to release this paint kind of like that. Maybe I want to just go I will tear this off. Anyway, it's okay. I think that I had way too much paint for that. I don't know if you even see my tilting part. I don't know. I'm lately kind of <laughs> feeling a little weird. Now I need to tear this line that it will complete the composition to here. Go back to the middle. exactly what I had in my head but as 
I lately see that I really struggle with letting go my expectations because in fluid art you had to sometimes yeah some part some it's intentional to a degree but sometimes so nice to just let go the expectations oh my god and i did it maybe it should be there so be it. a planet over this kind of landscape just working on my corners but just feel that it needs to go The paint will level out anyway, so it will be good. So, what I have now. Oop! Don't throw this, Fiona. Because I kind of like it and I'm curious how it will be, how it will dry with all this gold and bronze and pearl, of course. Definitely a light piece. I'm kind of wondering if I want to tilt a little more to that side. I don't know why. Why I can't stop, you see? Here comes the thing that you can't let go of your expectations. And I failed again. Let's see. What will happen if I just try to tilt a little of this off? And I definitely stretched out some cells out a little bit with that. Back to the middle. embellish it with some tree or something so I will leave it for now to dry 
So I turn on the lights that maybe we can catch some shimmer on the wet painting it even kind of like this look there is just my negative space and this is copper what uh, copper not copper bronze what it looks brown now so I think it will be quite nice painting when it will be dry so stay tuned for the dried results so here is the dried result love it love the shimmer Love the composition, love the negative space, I love it and maybe I will add a tree right here, embellish it, I don't know. Tell me in the comments what you think, should I add a tree to that painting or leave it like it is uh, and I will show you the dried result from my previous portio because a lot of you asked for it so this will come next and let me in the comments what do you think should I leave it or embellish it with a tree so here are the dried results of the previous pour I still think that my Composition is quite off, uh, but it dried beautifully. Maybe I should just cut it, you know, in this part and reframe it because I love this part, maybe like this, and then. The second part can be maybe I should have like that. This part alone and this part alone I think would be beautiful. <laughs> so I have a question about this too if you are still here. What do you think? Should I do two, two paintings from this one or should I leave it? I would definitely vote for, oh, sorry for my finger, for making two paintings from it. I really want to know what you think about that. See you on the next one.